The narrative in the Southern Utah Weber State rivalry has been fairly consistent for the past half decade. The Thunderbirds, an overachieving team, and the Wildcats, a team perpetually looking for consistency. However, the script may have changed in 2016 as Weber State, 3-0 in the Big Sky, travels down to Cedar City to play the Thunderbirds. We give you an inside look at the thoughts and feelings of both teams as they get ready for the matchup, starting first with the Wildcats here in Ogden. Uh, we believe we can win and we trust we can win. We trust the process and we're not looking past anything. Every day we come in and watch film. We practice the right way and we lift the right way. We eat the right way. God's doing the right thing. When you do the right things off the field, on the field, take care of yourself. Well, most of the times you don't have to say much. Yeah. It's it's pretty well understood. You better you better be up, up for this game or uh, or your opponent's going to get you. And uh, it's no different. This, this game last year, we came in... Um, maybe a little too excited, too hyped, and the emotion of the game got to us and we didn't perform well. Where on the flip side of that, I thought they handled it perfectly and played well. Uh, the year before that, it was an absolute war back and forth. We had a late lead, they took the lead. Um, that's rivalry games. If you, if you come with the wrong mindset, that's not good. Yeah, we, um, we just know that we got to come prepared, focused, um, determined, have a good week of practice, and just really be ready for these guys. They're a strong opponent and rivalry game, so you know everyone's going to bring their all. Welcome to Eccles Coliseum in Cedar City, Utah, on the campus of Southern Utah University. The Thunderbirds starting this season at three and three, hoping to move to four and three with a victory over Weber State tomorrow. The Thunderbirds know well the best type of four and three is a four and three with a win over a longtime in-state rival vital for the next three months we'll be talking about this game one way or the other we're talking about uh, either building for the future or what we did uh, in this last game and so that's a huge recruiting pitch on the on the on the, uh, on the recruiting trail we get a trophy when they come on campus you show them the trophy so uh, that this is a huge recruiting uh, tool for our coaching staff and for the future of the program and so yeah these, these rivalry games are vital because you compete against the same people and they're gonna go to each stadium and whoever has that trophy just has a little bit extra uh, in their bag when, when they when they talk to these recruits and their parents well, I think uh, it's a big deal for everybody, but especially for us guys that are actually from Utah and especially from up north, um, there's a lot of us that are, you know, from the Ogden area. Yeah. And, uh, you know, we grew up, you know, right next to those guys. And so, um, you know, and, uh, a lot of us weren't even recruited by them. So, you know, it's, it's a big deal. You know, you're playing against your hometown team for some of us and, uh, yeah, it's a huge deal. And I think the younger guys now who are on the team are starting to realize how big of a deal it is as well. When an offensive scores, there's always some kind of mistake on defense. So we try and look at what Montana State did wrong or what other teams have done wrong. And I mean, you're never gonna have a perfect game, but the team that makes the less mistakes is gonna, is gonna win. So that's our goal tomorrow. Uh, they have a great offense. I'm very familiar with one of their receivers, Drew Batchelor. He, he's, he's a great player, so. It'll be fun to play against him. The quarterback, he's gotten a lot better from last year. Um, but like I said, the team that makes the, few, the fewest mistakes is gonna win the game. The Thunderbirds and the Wildcats duel in Cedar City tomorrow night, 6 p.m. Mountain Time kickoff on WatchBigSky.com. To the winner go the spoils, an in-state rivalry victory, and a chance to continue contending for a Big Sky Conference title. With the Thunderbirds and the Wildcats in Cedar City, Utah for the Big Sky Conference, I'm John Oglesby.